Hey guys, this is Tim with Sound Mike Productions. Today we're going to be doing a tutorial showing you the basics of this animation, which is a cube that explodes, has a time freeze and a camera movement, another time freeze, boom. Cool little animation, very simple to do. Let's first get started by adding a plane. Scale the plane up pretty large. We'll add a cube. Make the cube 50, 50, 50. Hit C on the cube. Go to MoGraph, Cloner Object. Drop the cube into the Cloner Object. Click the Cloner Object. Mode, Grid Array for the count. 10, 10, 10. Drag the corner object up. Now for the corner object in the plane, we're going to add a tag, MoGraph tag, rigid body. For the plane, same tag, MoGraph, rigid body. And that should be it for the explosion. Boom. Explodes, hits the plane. Pretty cool. Now if we add a camera movement, let's add a camera. Click this button. This will show you the scene, scene camera, what the camera sees. At frame one, we'll keyframe. Uh, I have it set up for 200 frames. You can change that right here. You probably, you, if you first open it up, it'll be 90 frames. I have it set for 200 frames. So I'm gonna go to the end of my animation. 200 frame, move the camera, keyframe, now you have a nice little camera movement. Now for the time freeze, you need to go to edit, project settings, and the time scale is what we're going to be using. One is 100% real time, so for the freeze time we're going to need to put it down to zero. So what we're going to do is go find out where we want to freeze it. We'll freeze it here. Well, we'll freeze it at frame 20. So what you need to do is go back 10 frames. Control click, time scale, set a keyframe. Go up 10 frames, set it to zero. Control click, keyframe. Now it'll be frozen and wherever if you want it to stop at 170, drag it back to 160, 10 frames, control click, keyframe, up 10 frames, change it back to 1, control click, add the keyframe, now it'll drop. So it'll be frozen. Explode, freeze, drops. Pretty cool, very simple. Thanks for watching, more tutorials to come.